Hey everybody, today is Wednesday, April 26, 2023 in sunny San Diego, California, and I'm Captain Perry here with you. If you're new to the channel, behind me here is a scow bow mini cruiser that I'm building. Basically, my mission here is to build a strong, trailerable 14-foot sailboat that's watertight and custom built to cross oceans. In the last episode, I attached the port side panel to the boat. I fiberglassed it on at the bow and at the stern. And this week, I'm going to move to the inboard side, fiberglassing it on to every frame. Oh, and real quick before we begin, I have a goal to get to 10,000 subscribers during this summer, 2023. We've still got a long way to go, so please do me a favor and hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And if you like, share this video with a friend. All right, let's get to it. In order to fiberglass a lot of the inboard side of this side panel here, I realize I'm going to need a raised working platform here. So I've broken down a lot of free pallet wood, and I'm just going to throw one together. To correctly size the fiberglass cloth for the area between frames C3 and C4, I'm going to use a ticking stick. I tape on a piece of paper, then use a stick with two notches cut in it. I mark where the notches lay over the paper when the end of the stick is on the edge of the area. Now I have a kind of map of this section. I lay it on my cloth and use it to mark up my fiberglass for perfect cutting. When I'm done using it, I fold it up and save it for later use on the starboard side. Now the side panel is fiberglassed on from the bow back to frame two to frame three. Now it gets a little bit trickier because for these last three sections that need to get done, one, two, three, there's a little ring frame that I'm going to put from the bottom to the top for extra support. So I've cut those out of foam already and I'm going to go ahead and attach them. All right, I've glued on these bare foam pieces that are the ring frames. Next, going to fiberglass them on. Okay, it's nighttime now, and this section's done from C3 to C4 and over the ring frame. We do one section at a time. I'll give you the top view. I like to clamp the top with some pieces of cardboard 
just so it doesn't curl off the edge. So that's C3 to C4 done. Now tonight I move on to C4 to C5. I already got the fillets on there four hours ago. Now I'm going to fiberglass. All right, and there's that work finished. You can see I had to stop here because that's as far as I can reach. So all along through here, that bottom part will have to be done from inside at a later date. And finally, we come to the last section, inside the aft cargo hold. All right, there is the port side panel all attached. For next week, I'm gonna move on to cabin sole hatches. A big thank you to my patrons. In addition to supporting the build, Patreon members watch episodes one day early. Another great way to support the project is through the Amazon wish list. If you want to help out too, there are several links down in the description you can check out. If nothing else, hit the like button, leave a comment, and make sure you're subscribed. That's all free. All right, guys, I will see you in the next one. Before Dallas make all preparations for getting underway. Hey, yeah. Uh...